Alhamdulillah, Rabbi Alameen, Allah, Akbar. I'm Muslim, and I believe in Jesus, but I don't believe in Jesus as being God or the Lord. Jesus says that I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father but by me. He's the only way to the Father. That's the Bible. Islam came centuries later. There was no Christianity, no Judaism, no anything. When Abraham, may Allah be pleased with him, when he came here, what he believed in was one creator, one God. He was considered a Muslim. Are you able to think of the two sons of Abraham? So you have Isaac and Ishmael. Isaac was the son of the promise through Sarah. She was very old and God opened up her womb. Ishmael was the son of the flesh. It was through the maid. Islam is a descendant from Ishmael. Christianity is a descendant from Isaac, who was the son of the promise. So all the way back to Abraham, whenever he had the son of the promise in Genesis, it was Isaac. It was Abraham and Sarah, and they were very old. And God opened up her womb. It was it was a miracle. But Abraham also had a relation with the young maid, and they had birth a natural way, which was Ishmael. Islam comes from Ishmael. Christianity comes from Isaac. Isaac was the son of promise. Ishmael was the son of the flesh. So the eyewitnesses of Jesus saw him crucified for no. our sins. And the Quran comes centuries later and says that he only appeared to be crucified. Now, who are you going to believe? Eyewitnesses who lived at the time of Jesus or a book that comes centuries later called the Quran that because said he only appeared? The Bible was written by me. People who wrote about Jesus were not even with Isa. Matthew was and John was. They were both disciples. And Mark got his information from Peter, who was a disciple. And I was raised Christian. It's sad that you departed Jesus. from, from oh, the truth. no. Alhamdulillah, Rabbi Alameen. Allah, Akbar. Jesus said, before Abraham was, I am. That's what he said from his own words. So before Abraham was, he is. He is he, eternal. Quran talks about Jesus, but the Bible never talks about Muhammad. It does. Ahmad. It does not. Jesus says, follow the one that will come after me that will be the peacemaker. His name will be Ahmad. Can you tell me where he says that? Chapter and verse in the Bible? No, I can't tell you from that. Jesus was crucified for our sins. I don't buried, believe that. And no. he rose from the dead on the third day. He was witnessed to die and rise again by eyewitnesses. The Quran comes centuries later and says that Jesus only appeared to be crucified. That's so correct. who are you going to believe? Eyewitnesses? I believe the Quran Or the a book that came centuries later that never saw Jesus. But I can't believe what a man wrote down over what God revealed. The Bible is a revelation from God. I, but people no. wrote it down. Prophets wrote it down. John wrote it. Peter wrote it. No. You have the prophets. So Peter, John, and the prophets and more wrote the Bible. You're saying on the third day. It's a revelation from God. So, I no, I can't believe that. Here's your hope for salvation. How are you going to go into well, paradise, to heaven? I don't know if I will get to Jenna, and I know that I will only get to Jenna if I make no association with my Creator, with God. Is it based on your good deeds outweighing your bad deeds? Is that how you get in? Not 100%, no. So you can't be certain if you'll make it, correct? Absolutely not. No one can be certain. I see Christians can be certain because I have a Savior who died for me and rose from the dead. And he, he took away my sin. He paid the price for me. And I'm going to be with the Lord Jesus in eternal life because of what he did and uh, not what I did. That's the hope of the gospel. So then you're saying it doesn't make any difference what you do here. Then. He calls us to obey him and follow him and walk with him. Uh, see, once somebody accepts the Lord Jesus, their life is transformed. But he's not the Lord. He's he, a man. He, he absolutely is the Lord. How is he the Lord? He's the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. I promise you that he is the Son of God and he is the only no, Savior. you just took God. I'm not going to be able to change you. What, what was your name? I can't touch you. I'm sorry. Okay.